Hey everybody, Jim from Cigar Cigar Cigars, and today I am reviewing the Milanio Serie V by Oliva. Got to tell you, I have some history with this cigar, and it's all good. This is a robusto size, about I think it's five inches by 52, so it's pretty pretty approachable cigar. Easy to I I love this size because you can just kind of get into it. You're not committing to to a Churchill or something like that. I've smoked some Churchills of the Milanio, and they are, in my opinion, not as good as the Robusto size. So, um, the, this cigar, a little history, is named after Milanio Oliva, who actually was growing tobacco in Cuba in the in the famous Pinar del Rio region way back in the late 1800s, and um, when when. He actually ended up emigrating to Nicaragua, and, and, and uh, that's how the Oliva family ended up there. So I'm going to give this thing a light here. Before I do that, I wanted to show the cut on this. If you do a Robusto, if you're going to smoke a Robusto or a short cigar, it's not a bad idea to use like a V-cut. I actually do a V-cut in both directions. And it gives you a little, a little bit uh, more draw, I think. But uh, a V cut is a good thing to do if you, if you have been using just a straight cut, uh, guillotine type cutter. Um, you get a V cutter for seven or eight bucks on Amazon. So uh, not a bad idea to try it for a short cigar. It's a good idea. One of the things I love about a Milanio cigar is that it is good. Some cigars, if you if you if you've had experience doing that smoking, um, some cigars you start out and, and, and they kind of have to settle in. You know, you, the first few puffs and first couple minutes, you're going, oh, I'm not sure about this cigar. Milanio from the first draw, there is no question. It is a it is a tasty cigar, sweet, um, kind of cedary. Um, it's got some strength to it. I'm gonna I'm gonna say it's probably about a, an eight or something like that. So But the balance is nice the balance is nice and and you don't get that overpowering uh, strength So if you're comparing this to the regular Siri V by Oliva, I would say this is a smoother smoke Probably about the same strength. Maybe this is a little bit less uh, but a, but definitely a, a, a smoother smoke. So I'm going to enjoy the rest of this, and I will get back to you in a few minutes and, and report back. I'm back. We have been reviewing the Oliva Milanio Serie V cigar. Look at that ash on there. It is a beautiful, beautiful ash. Interesting thing, I've read somewhere that a white ash, like you see, there. That whiteness is a good sign because it basically is minerals that are in the tobacco plant which in minerals lend flavor and complexity and so forth. So we see that that's a good thing. I want to get rid of that though. So this one as usual did not disappoint. Very good cigar. Um, I'm gonna rate this a nine and a half. This is one of the one of the best cigars I know, uh, I've, you know, I've seen mixed reviews on it a little bit, but by and large, I think people agree that it, it at least is a good cigar, if not a great cigar. So, I'm pairing this today, kind of unusually, because it's earlier in the day, with, with a cup of coffee. And this cigar lends itself really well. It, that almost has, it has almost a coffee-ness to it. So, that in a, in a nice glass of ice water on a pretty warm day. I gotta admit, I had a late night last night. Um, Kind of a slow morning. My neighbor had the nerve last night at 3 a.m. to start pounding on my door. It's a good thing I was still up playing my drums, so it didn't—he didn't really bother me. So, um, I think that's about. We're going to leave it at that because there's some groans going on. I can hear. So we're going to leave it at that and say, try if you haven't tried a Milanio Series Five by Oliva, give it a try. It, it, is, it is a good cigar and worth your time. From Cigar, Cigar, Cigars, I'm Jim. I will see you next time.